Hello Planet YouTube, how are you? Hope you're all okay. Um, it is 2.56pm on Thursday the 28th of February. Um, um, yeah, we're just we're going to get on with things today. So let's get on. Uh, welcome to Today in My Bujo. I hope everybody is okay. If you're wondering where yesterday's episode is, it's on the end of the live. I need to go through the live and put um, timestamps in the description so that you can find it if you want to. Um, I'm quite tired. It's been a really long day already. Really long. Okay, so yesterday. Oh, I'm exhausted. It's my daughter's birthday yesterday. And uh, she turned 24. And today, my son turns 23. So, yeah. I'm going to Southampton with my daughter tomorrow as a birthday treat. Getting a takeaway and a little drinkies tonight as a birthday treat for my son. Um, yeah, I haven't bought a card. I literally got up and um, went out this morning because I had appointments. Did I do that last night? I should have done. No, I didn't look. Oh. Yes, I did. Yesterday was 27. Oh, I did that on the wrong day then. Oh, bugger, did I do the wrong day there? I thought I did that last night. I don't know if I've missed a day. It was a reasonably good day, I think. So yesterday was another good day. Let's quickly just fill this in and get up to date. Yesterday was another good day. Um, with, you know, slight levels in pain. Today I'm in absolute fucking agony, but... There you go. Did all of this before I went to bed last night. Let's jump over to today's pen. Sleep. Oh, sleep. I love sleep. I don't get anywhere near enough, though. Oops. So, 10 past 10 to 7.45. Uh, 10 past 12, sorry, to 7.45. Go back a bit later and do all the black lines, just to make it look a bit neater. All right. I've done the loo and the laundry. Bloody rain, which I was a bit annoyed about. Um, I haven't done anything else yet. So, that is done. That is done. And that's about it so far. Oh dear me, I'm so tired. Uh, Box opened as I picked it up. Oh. Fuck's sake. <sighs> it's a bloody squid ink. Yeah, it was. It was a bloody squid ink. An aqua dolce. Get in there. Shitty things. Right. How frustrating. I ordered a new stencil. It's got really nice style of numbers on it. I'm hoping it might arrive tomorrow. And then what I might do is like... Um, um 
do a stencil a month so you know so like do the new stencil throughout March and then maybe do this one throughout April or I don't know I don't really know how to do this one. I don't want to overlay lay it again because it had that bloody fit yesterday, the other day, didn't I? I could do it like that. Yeah. Right. Ugh. Let's find a colour we haven't used. What's that one? Gold champagne. That sounds nice, doesn't it? Have I used gold champagne? She says merrily knocking everything flying. No, I haven't. Somebody asked me on my live last night um, how I keep it all organised so that I don't end up with paper everywhere. I'm only bringing it up in case, you know, you don't like to watch live replays. I know I don't. If I miss it, I've missed it, you know, because I can't join in. Um, and, um, yeah, she said to me, you know, well, how do you keep it all in? That's nice. Keep it all together and, and not making a mess. Those paper clips. Paper clips and binder clips. Um, I'll show you in a sec. No, I'll show you now while I've got free hands. Basically, like these are all done, and I don't need to use these again because they're journal pages that I finished with. So they've been put together with a paper clip. The next batch, these are weeklies that I finished. So they're all together with a paper clip. And then January is all together with a binder clip. Okay, and that just means that I can then flick through in chunks and I can normally find where I need to be just by looking for paper clips or binder clips dependent on what I'm doing um, I do have a binder coming Wendy is sending me one and if she can't I'm going to have a look around in town and see if I can find one basically what I want is I want an A5 binder with a wide enough spine to take the entire journal because I want the whole thing together in one book just you know if I've gone through the agony of um, loose leafing it then I'd like to put it all together at the end of it that was my original plan I was going to bind it myself and um, put it in a uh, put it in a thing myself but um, due to the fact that um, binder coils don't go that thick I then had to rethink and I'd already started the journal obviously didn't do my research um, so my next thought was well I could maybe just stick it all in a ring binder and that's essentially what I'm going to do so once it's in a ring binder I won't have all that hassle of trying to keep it all together I should just mark the like most recent month or something and go from there or the most recent page that I'm on that's pretty not sure about this bloody great gap though I don't know whether to cut it and close it up you know just the way the stencil came it's one of the ones that I didn't cut uh, yeah wait stop licking um right did I change but yeah I changed but that's how tired I am I have no idea what the fuck I'm doing what is it that's <laughs> oh can I go to bed yet trying really hard to make my lettering more bouncy and and you know I actually really like how that's come out really pleased with that <laughs> funny isn't it some days you do it and you're like yes got it did it <laughs> and then other days you're like what the fuck is that 
Oh, it is. We've got a bit of everything today. Oh, excuse me. At the moment, it's grey skies. Earlier, it rained. This morning, it was blue and sunny and, yeah. So, we're all over the bloody place at the moment. So, it looks like that's a giant cloud. I am so crap at drawing clouds. And a little itty bitty sun. And, and even some rain, look. Rain, rain, rain. Okay. Sun came up at 6.52. And it's going to go down at 5.44 this evening. Okay. Oh, dear me. Oh dear, we well, we got to cover that up soon, and then I can remove the sticky note from it. Tomorrow is March. Wow. I didn't really deco. I should have decorated that. I might do it across the bottom, just to say that my daughter was 24. I could put some mushy, couldn't I? If I can fit her name in there. <laughs> oh, I really like how I've done that. <laughs> yeah, pleased with that. If you're wondering what it is that I do over at the side here, I've got this massive pencil case thing. One of these. And this is what I keep all my pens in. So my front and pens live in there until they come into use and then they get taken out. Because they're a pain in the ass to keep taken out where they're so thick and heavy. Um... So they stay in there until they come into use. The fine liners I use for colour coding are over here. So, like, you know, this is mine, my partner's, my mum's, um, my business, no, YouTube, my business, children, one, two, three, four, and five, pets, Fitbit, my partner's parents, and anything to do with money. So there you go. I know what it all is. I should do like a tip in for the front of the binder when I come to bind it. These are my new pens that I got recently. I really want to use these. And I did consider replacing these with this. I don't drive my partner's parents about quite as much anymore. He, he tends to do that. So I could lose that colour. And I'm really tempted, but I would run out of some of these before I'd run out of others. So I don't know. I might do. And then I can put these back in the fine line of tin they came in which is this one because i don't need i don't use these as much anymore they're all right they're all over the place there so I'm, i might do that i might go through it all and go yeah, sod it. And then i put the fine liners away for a bit and then if i want to chop and change i can i don't think these will go in and out of there very well because the rubbery grips but yeah and then i've got my Craft knife, scissors, glue stick, tape runner, pokey thing, uh, white out pen, my little fountain pen that's currently in use. That doesn't go in these very well because it's so, so thick, so that just stays down here. Uh, my other little pair of scissors. And then if I need to move them about, I chuck all of my pit artist pens, my pencil, my eraser pen. My Tombow, Fuji Nisaki is usually in there. My ruler, but then I lose my, because it's see-through, I lose my ruler. Yeah, <laughs> so I try to keep that one out on my desk so that I can see it. Certain things stay out on my desk because I would just lose them in this. It's chaos. So, yeah. And, uh, oh, I've got in here a syringe for filling up my fountain pens. It's got a blunt needle, so... It just makes it easier to fill up my pens. And then um, the reason I do it this way is so that when I start writing with them, I don't get a glob where they've been dipped in a bottle of ink. Um, this is 
That's when Daryl had longer hair as a toddler. He made this in preschool for me. It's just a lid with a photograph inside. I think they just stuck it down, but I love it. So yeah, that stays in here. So yeah, there you go. <laughs> Little nose at a part of my my desk. <laughs> and then when you see me move things over there, like my phone, I usually dump it on top of here. So that lives literally that that far away from this edge of my journal. Okay, you've got my root. Actually, hang on. So you've got my ruler and my pens. There's the washi that I used in the live last night. I haven't put it away yet. That is a big mug of more pens and other scissors and tools to use. So yeah, there's my pencil case, baby monitor. What's that? Oh, that was a letter I got today. And then there's my drawers, my Calax drawers there. Uh, that one is... What's that in there? That bottom one is inks and embossing stuff. The one above it is the one that's got the gelatos in because I use those. So I did it in pink because that's the colour that I use for her. So today is Alex's birthday. And I think I'm going to tape across the top in the same... Or should I do happy birth? No, because I'm going to write happy birthday. So I'm going to use the same tape just to make it noticeable. Alex is the one that lives with me. His link is down in the description because he's a gamer and I try to promote his channel whenever I can. It's harder for gamers, I think, than it is for bullet journalers because we all get our favourite bullet journalers that we like to follow. But game, even when you're playing new games, everybody else is playing them. And it's really, really hard to get a fan base up. So, you know, I'd really, really appreciate if you guys could just go like some of his YouTube videos or something. Or just, you know, stick them on when you're not at your computer and get his number count up. It would do him a world of good. Either on YouTube. Well, YouTube would get his YouTube numbers up. And if you like watching somebody else play video games, he streams every day from 1pm UK time. Right. <clears throat> so then I would go. I, like I love that washi. It's really nice. It's just candles. It's really cool. Okay. Oh, ambulance. I live on the main route between the lower part of the the south part of the island and the hospital, so they all go screaming past me on a regular basis. Okie cokey. Yeah, I like I like I've done that actually. <laughs> God, he's twenty three. When did that happen? It's just not fair. All my babies grow up. Right, where's my chore chart for today? I don't know how much I'm going to get done. Ah, oh, do the kitchen door and the window. Yeah, it's not going to get done. Bannister probably will and the bath and sink probably will. And then the rest of it will get done later on tonight. But I think I'll go and do those in a minute. Can't be bothered to do windows today. I don't think I did windows yesterday or the day before. Oh, look, I haven't done my office window for a month according to this. That's bad, isn't it? I haven't done any of my monthly things either. Oh dear me, that's not very good. Oh well. My own fault. Well, I was ill and, you know, got a bit overwhelmed, I think, with everything. So, right. Anyway, there we go. Looking forward to moving into March tomorrow. Um, obviously, I've got. Um, Oh, I've got the rest of this week to finish off, but my monthly will move into March. Um, I might just sort of put the rest of this aside because it is getting a bit bulky to move it all about and just basically work on the month, keep the month going. So, yeah. I need to write in there going to Southampton. It's so 
such a dark, dark purple. It's nice. It doesn't bleed through any more or less than any other pen does. You know? Yeah, I might well switch over to these instead of all my fine liners. Especially for the black. I mean, that was that I wrote in the black version of these. But it's so much darker, you know? These are the gel point seven. I'd see I wasn't able to find the whole pack in a smaller nib. So if anybody knows where I could find the pack of fourteen in a smaller nib, that'd be awesome. We, I might even just buy a black one and a smaller nib. But yeah, we'll see. Right, there we go. I'm off to get on with my day. Um and I will hopefully hopefully be back this evening to um close down. Um Somebody did come up with a suggestion for what we call the evening doohickey, but it was a bit long. I literally want something like, you know. I don't know. What can I call it? I really don't know. Just like the evening edition. Oh, yeah, that sounds quite cool, doesn't it? Today, my Bujo, and the evening edition. What do you think? Will that work? Do you like the evening edition? Yeah, we'll see. I might do it tonight and test it out. But like I said, um, we're going to have a little party tonight for my son. So I might get a little bit drunk, which means I might, come, you know, just not come back and do tonight. So um, if I don't, I will try to remember to upload it. I'm going to edit it and get it all ready now, just in case. Just in case. Um, so, yeah, if it gets uploaded and there's no ending to it, that's why. I got drunk <laughs> and it's been a while since I had alcohol. I don't think I've had any this month. Um, let's have a look. No, but oh, I, had, I had a drink on the first. I didn't have a drink all the time I was ill. Yeah, no, so I've had no booze at all. So I haven't had a drink. I'll have to look at January's then. Oh, yeah, the 31st of January. I had some, I think. Two, three, four. Yeah. Well, I didn't colour it in, so it looks like it. Why did I not have any on the 31st of January then? Why did I have some other? No, see, I went, that was the night I came down with the fever. So that can't be bloody right. Oh, am I looking at that? Yeah. yeah weird, I don't know. Obviously got confused here somewhere amongst all of this being so poorly. 28. Uh, yeah, I think that was the night we stayed up to watch Rumble and I think we had a little drink. Because we had a bit of a giggle on that. And I thought I was a little bit hungover, but it turned out I wasn't. And I was coming down with this fucking flu. I was feeling really, really tired. Yeah, I did this page Friday. See, I wrote a note there. I did it on the on the Friday the first because I felt I was starting to feel really ill, and then yeah, and then I didn't do anything. I did the first. Went to bed early with a fever. There you go. Oops, I got washi tape stuck to me. Um, spent the night alternating between shivering and, and then I just went downhill from there and I was really gutted because I wanted to do um, the Charlie and the Chocolate Factory who do you mean? and then I didn't journal for a week <laughs> yeah I wrote things went downhill from there I've basically been in bed or on the sofa I have the flu I've never been this ill I've n I'd never had the flu that's why it's actually such a big thing for me because wow <laughs> yeah and I still have a bloody sore throat, so there you go. Anyway, right, I'm off. I'm rambling. Um, take it easy. I hope you have a great day. Like I said, if there's no end, I got drunk. Welcome back to, what are we calling this? The evening edition? The evening edition. Um, I hummed and hard about whether to actually do an evening edition. 
because I've had quite a lot to drink <laughs> and I haven't actually done anything. So um, I did reorganise my pen case. I did take out all the fine liners and skipped to using just the, um, the ink joy gel pens. I even wrote myself a little scruff, scruffy key for now. Um, I will do a proper tip in later. But I need something like a journaling card. Um, Amanda sent me these ones. But they're coloured on the back. Uh, one's a sort of, I don't know what colour you call that, parchment. And the other is a dusky rose. I need one with a white back to make a nice tip in. Um, I might, <coughs> she says, if you can remember where she put the ruddy things. I've got some little cards somewhere or other. Could use one of those, I suppose. Because I can't remember where I put them. <coughs> I've got these nice cards and they're white inside so I could use one of these as a tip in for a key which I might well do and just copy that over um, yeah so I'm going to use that out so I might do that so it's got my phantom pens in there my pen of the day in there all my ink joy pens I did try and put them in here but they're just too big and the rubbery barrels stop them from sliding in so quickly. So they can live in here with my scissors, my little, little pen, ruler, glue stick, uh, my craft knife. This is my chunky pencil that I've had since I was about nine years old. And it's something should be like a two mil nib or something. It probably says under there. I don't know, it's really flipping chunky. Um, and the other bits and bobs. All of my pet artist, artist pens are here. Yeah, so that works quite well. So it's all in there. So I did do a little bit of organising. I tied it under my desk, which is cool. So <coughs> I'm going to do the little bits. <laughs> so uh, I have a drink. Have a drink. I, d I don't even want to think about how many that is that I've done. I haven't worn makeup, I haven't done challenges. I've had booze, I've had fizzy, I've had caffeine. Oh, hang on, I lost count there. Makeup, challenges, booze, fizzy, caffeine, chips, craft. <laughs> I'll do a gratitude now. And then um, we'll do that in a minute when we get to the weekly page. I've just caught up on all the wrestling this week. <clears throat> excellent, excellent editions of Raw and Smackdown. <coughs> Excuse me. If you're not a wrestling fan, that will mean absolute fuck all to you. I, however, have been watching WWE wrestling since I was about nine years old. So, um, yeah. Ruler, ruler, and I have the gone. <sighs> mood. My mood is... You know what? I'm going to put my mood at 10 out of 10 for today. It has been really, really good. And my pain at the moment, I'm drunk. I can't put a bloody thing. There you go. Excellent end to the year. Um, can't do sleep or stats. Can't do stats for another 40 minutes. <coughs> oh, pardon me. Pen of the day again. I didn't do that, that, that. I did clean my office. I cleaned under my desk and I can now actually push my chair in, which is really cool. And I organised... Oh, my fucking phone. Can you hear it going bzzzed? Um, I organised all of my things like my um, scoreboard, my stamp... Oh, what do you call them? Stamping jig? Is that what it's called? Like a misty, but not... Um, hang on, it's not a misty because it's not a misty but Stamp Perfect it's called, Stamp Positioning Tool One of them, my scoreboard, my paper trimmer and my stamp cleaner Are all in one of those letter organiser things with the three sections Yeah, um, so I did that and I, I actually made space on the floor which was really, really nice So yes, I've cleaned my office, I haven't cleaned Daryl's table, I haven't filled the dishwasher, I haven't done anything in the kitchen 
<laughs> so bit, where the fuck is my phone? Oh, everything's all turned around. What are we doing? <coughs> I haven't done anything on there. I am so bad. All right, let's put in a... Mm, rum! Because that's what I've been drinking. Um, and that's pretty much it. I'm going to journal in a minute. Look, I've got a lot to say. I haven't really done much. Um, but yeah, that's that's more or less it really until tomorrow. Um, I'm out for the day. Hopefully, I'll get time to do this in the morning before I go out. If not, it will be in the evening when I get home. So yeah, there you go. Um, sorry, I'm a bit giggly, <laughs> giggly, but I've had quite a good evening with my boy. Um, just we've been watching wrestling. It's it's been it's been really nice actually. So, pardon me, all that run. Um, there you go. Please feel free to leave this video with thumbs up. <laughs> um, if you hit the book, you'll be subscribed. And if you hit the bell, you'll be uh, notified when I upload new content. Please leave me a comment. I love interacting with you guys, even when I'm in this sorry state. <laughs> um, Hey, and questions you know questions are great because it gives me something to talk about in the blank bits when I don't know what to say I can at least answer a question so if you've got any questions don't matter what they are you know they can be personal for all I give them monkeys um anything you want to know let me know you know I don't know do you want to know what's on my desk or um what my other hobbies are I don't know anything anything you want to know Stick it in the questions and I will put a banner across here showing your question and I will try and answer it in a future stream. It is now 25 past 11 on Thursday evening. I've got a very, very full day planned for tomorrow. So I think it's time I shut everything down and uh, thought about going to bed. So take it easy, guys. Hope you have a good one. Nighty-night.